Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to the funding. Team funding is going today to Aura Art. This is a really unique local brand that is focusing on making custom handmade bags. So we are about to head to Denpasar, find out about their business. As I am scrolling through their Instagram, you can see that uh, most of their bags are actually inspired from luxury brands. But what makes this brand unique is that they are combining modern with ethnic style. Today we're gonna find out about how they're making this, what is the ideology behind their business. contoh yang tas yang sudah jadi. Itu salah. Oke okay guys, and right now I'm with Prami. Prami, uh, tell a little bit about yourself. Nama saya Prami, jadi uh, saya pemilik dan founder Aura Art Handmade Bag. Uh, Aura Art ini uh, spesialisasinya pembuatan tas-tas custom. That was a little bit about your product. So, tas-tas yang saya buat itu kebanyakan dari fabric, dari dari kain ya, endek, uh, songket, kayak gitu. How did you come up with the business idea? Ah. Uh, saya memang tertarik dengan tas hmm. kayak gitu dan uh, dari situ saya belajar untuk menjahit tas hmm. karena tidak banyak yang menjahit tas kan yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, jadi emang kepo kalau orang mm -hmm. bilang ih kepo banget nih pengen jahit tas akhirnya belajar dan ya sampai sejauh ini usually who are your customers mostly kebanyakan sih ibu-ibu ya hmm. yang sebaya wanita bekerja lah Okay, so let's say like 35 and up. Yep, 30. 30, 30, and up. 30. Okay. 30 masih bisa. How many of those bags can you produce in one day for the customer? Uh, sehari itu dua sampai tiga. Dua sampai tiga. So it means that you take like a couple hours to create one, I guess. Yeah, yeah. A couple uh, hours. Four hours. Four hours. Yeah. Kurang, lebih, yeah. Kurang yeah. lebih ya. Kurang lebih empat jam. Yeah. So, what is like a rough estimation of your production price and your selling price? Uh, it's another 100%. Mm. Jadi harga dasar mm -hmm. ke harga Okay. 100%. Okay. 100%. Okay. So, if you can choose anyone in the world, who would be your dream customer? Ibu Nilo Jerantik. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dan berharap banget bisa ketemu dengan Oke, oke, oke. Pembuat ini kulit ya? Yeah, kulit, yeah, yeah. kulit domba itu saya celup sampai 25 kali dengan pewarnaan basic. Berapa kali? 25 kali. 25 <laughs> kali. Can, can I feel it? Yeah. Oh, so this is like there's so much passion behind this to yeah, create this, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can tell. Oh, it's nice. It feels like it looks like already like a luxury bag. What is it that you really love about custom and handmade bags? Uh, custom bag itu lebih kepada kualitas ya. Hmm. Jadi kalau misalkan uh, itu kan pengerjaannya satu 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 ya. Okay. Jadi di kualitas jahitan, kekuatan, strong. Kadang-kadang hmm. kalau kita beli tas itu kan cepat yang pas tali itu yeah. cepat ya. Yeah. Uh -uh. Jadi kalau sudah kita jahit karena memang uh, memang untuk uh, kepuasan customer ya memang dibuat lebih kuat. Jadi kayak quality over quantity ya? Iya, uh, uh, dan juga custom. Jadi custom. yang pesan itu bisa okay, so request, the customer can uh, choose, choose kind of mau model like. apa, okay. kayak gitu. So usually like the customer also like comes here and then you, you can like choose yeah, the one first? Iya, kamu bisa pilih kain, uh, uh. Okay. jadi ada endek, ada yang kain-kain kayak gini juga. Iya, yeah. there's a lot of options ya. Yeah. So yeah, all of this like you can yeah. get back from it. Karena kan custom. Iya, yeah, I understand. Dan 
spécial. <laughs> Did anything happen with your business once the pandemic started? Uh, sebenarnya tuh ini ya kalau dari selling itu tetap karena saya sudah punya pelanggan. Hmm. Jadi kalau misalkan itu memang mereka kan ingin yang uh, spesial kayak gitu kan sebenarnya sih tetap penjualan dan okay. bahkan agak meningkat karena uh, maaf kan uh, apa? ada sebuah model tas itu yang lagi hit banget okay. dan meniru dari itu walaupun akhirnya kainnya saya ganti dengan kain-kain Bali enak Bali Oke, okay, terus modal tasnya itu lagi Modal tas itu lagi sedang booming banget okay. Dan saya ganti pakai kain, kain-kain band So let's say, you start with this What is mm-hmm. the next step that you're gonna do? Uh, masang ini Masang nama, jadi kita pakai lem Masang namanya How easy is it to do business in Indonesia? Kalau dibilang gampang, ya gampang Kita tinggal menemukan siapa customer kita Okay. Kalau kita sudah menemukan siapa customer kita, gampang banget. Oke. Okay. Gampang banget. Maybe then you have any advice for upcoming entrepreneurs or somebody who wants to start their own business? Just do it. Just do it. <laughs> it That's right. a good one. Just do it. <laughs> Alright guys, so today we had a really interesting talk. Sama ibu. Rami. Rami. <laughs> we also saw our workshop and for everybody who's interested in having their own custom bags, you can check them out at Ara Handmade Art. See you next time at the funding. Thank you. Thank you, the funding. <laughs> okay.